Hello and welcome to the class of 2015, the Marketing Academy. We've had 450 hours of mentoring, 360 hours of coaching, and we're here today to tell you our top career tips. So my top tip is to be energetic and excited about what you do. If you're not, who else will be? Make them want to work on your brand and project. My top Marketing Academy career tip is measure your life in significance, not in outward success. My top tip, less is more. Decide what's important and go after that. My top tip is if you have a campaign or idea, don't speed ahead at 90 miles an hour, look back in the rear view mirror and see you haven't brought your team with you. Things are a lot easier when you work as a team, unless you're this guy and you can do it all alone. My top tip would be to think about what your values are and what the values are of the company that you work for and see if they match up. So if they do, you're much more likely to be able to do a really good job. Take the time to think. Think about where you are and where you want to go. When it's complicated, do something. Don't be paralysed by complexity. Just take the first small step and everything else will fall into place. My top tip is if you're ever in times of stress, say to yourself, if Britney Spears can get through 2007, we can get through this. The most important thing is knowing where you want to get to, and then you just have to figure out how to get there. You may feel like you're making it up as you go along, but don't worry, everybody is. Just carry on faking it till you make it. The best tip that I received was to find the sweet spot between what you love, what you're good at, what the world needs, and what you get paid for, which is otherwise known as purpose. I got my job here at Arsenal because I followed my dreams, and you should too. Here's my tip. You don't always have to reinvent the wheel. Just keep it simple. My tip is, even though your bands make mistakes, don't dwell on them. Just focus on finding the solutions and learn from them. For me, it's all about people. No matter how amazingly talented or bright or clever or smart you are, if you don't get on with people, you're going to really struggle. So be nice, be self-aware, and try your best to see things from other people's perspectives. For me, I think it's really important to be yourself and be genuine, both who you are outside of work and how you are in your career. So the key thing for me is to spend some time thinking about where you want to be in 10 years time and accepting that it will be a lot more messy than uh, what you think it will be, but at least you have a direction to go to. So my advice is around the idea of 100% choice. So you've got the choice in how you want to react to something, whether it's positive or negative. It really is as simple as that. My advice is to chase the opportunity, not the job title. Go somewhere where you're going to learn something and stretch yourself, not for a new business card. Really know your worth. Never fall in love with a company because they'll never fall in love with you. Be authentic. Be the best version of yourself that you can be. My top tip is always look for jobs that stretch you and move before you're ready. Guys and girls, last bit of advice. It's better to ask for forgiveness than seek permission. Now let's go and take some risks.